I think what made this image stand out was the way that they framed the image. So like with the others, you would have the galaxy and you could see all of the background stars and it was sort of a more wide field view. He took a little bit of creative license and cropped it in and then did a really good job at actually processing the image. And we can see the HA data pop out. You can really see where all the nebulae are. The spiral arm is nice and sharp. You can see the different spiral arms going into the center of uh, the core of Messier 33. I think stars can be really pretty. Maybe that's an unpopular opinion. And I don't think that the stars distract from the image. They add to this like very powerful image of Messier 33. I don't know exactly how to describe it, but this is like an in-your-face image. Great image. Background is controlled nicely. If we zoom in, it's a little bit noisy, but like I don't think that noise is distracting, especially when you are looking at it like this you know, zoomed out. Nico Carver had a video talking about is astrophotography art. And he talked about how, you know, in astrophotography, we have certain degrees of freedom that we can play with, like rotation and field of view and things like that. And I think what this image does really well is it accentuates the galaxy. I think that's part of the reason that it won is that it made the galaxy the most important part of the image. Has has good color balance. The galaxy is sharpened really well. Congratulations, this is the winner. <laughs>